This is Kurt Hansen. If you're hearing this, you've come to the right place. NCPD, gang wars, not in Dogtown. Taxes, who the fuck needs them? In Dogtown, I keep your business safe as long as you abide by my rules. Sound fair to you? I thought so. bad is it for you? <sighs> Clock's ticking. And fast. Relic will finish me sooner rather than later. But you're here. Looking for a means to survive. Still fighting. Think you'd do anything for another chance? Can't deny it. Chin up. We're in this together. There is that. Come on over to mine tomorrow. Turns out I will be staying at the stadium after all. Good. Except... Hey, you... Fuck, dog! Think Hansen's personal protection takes five minutes and a handshake to lock down? Shake, don't shake. I don't fucking care. I'm up to my neck and shit. If they ask, just say we were diving at sea point. Who's got you? All right. Time you got up on the roof. The hell for? For the view. And I'm not being coy here. I mean, you'll see where we land, literally. or something. I detest wrinkles like this. When things don't go as planned. Yeah, forget about it. Chunk upon junk here. Finally. Pop in. Elevator's roofbound. FYI, we're about to cross into Night City airspace. President's holding up. Well, she's calmly, coolly securing her documents. Third or fourth time, though, so I'm clearly not the only one who's stressed.
You made it. Good. How's the sitch on board? Stable, but tensions rising. Unsurprisingly. See that? It's us. Space Force One. We're descending. And for a rough... Oh, fuck. What? What's going on? What the hell? Stalbert! V! The President! You have to... Stalbert! God damn it! Oh, shit, shit, shit! Fuck me! Save the president. Sure. No fucking problem. Songbird, thought you might have... Fuck! Yeah, I know, I know. Songbird the cat. Life number nine commenced. Alas. I made sure to get Myers to the safe before I ejected. Or to the wreckage bay. Save her! You need to hurry. What then? Got a plan? Find Myers, get her to Liz Crest Street. It'll be the safest spot in Dogtown right now. Right. I'll be in touch. Godspeed me.
the six. The target! The side, fuckers! Break! Attack! After me! Eleven on board, counting myself and Wasman. How many still alive? No idea. Must be some way I could. Wait, I got it. The crane arm. Hop on. I think I can put it up. Not a second to spare now. Across the roof. Wreck straight ahead. Fuck her in the ass, people! Everything's going to shit! on the way.
quick. Fuel tank's insulated. It won't explode. See anything? A whole lot of wrecked aircraft. Anyone alive? Nobody jumping out to greet me. Shit! Are we too late? Pretty quiet in here. Like, too quiet. That's true, then. We need to be sure. We need confirmation she's dead. Keep moving back. You'll see us safer. I'll pop the release on the door. If I do, you'll calm down? It depends. Who you are. Relax! Songbird sent me. And you are? Name's V. Apologies. I had to be sure it was really you. Great. Let's Delta.
Longbird. You there? V, how's the cinch? We're alive. Both of us. Now listen. Head for the vacant building on- Elizabeth Cress. Got it. <coughs> Give me some credit. It's the best place to lay low. No heat signatures, so it's empty. Not a soul inside. Now get moving. Got Songbird on comms. She's fine. Found us a safe house nearby, too. Songbird. Had started to worry. I suppose I forgot she always lands on her feet. That crazy look, both of you. Ah. <sighs> Maybe you brought it with you. dead. All of them. Because of me. Nightmare. Sure. So wake up. Look alive! As if it were that easy. You have no idea how deep this goes. We were hacked. It means Hansen had help. From Washington. The NUS government is aware of the crash, no doubt. They'll have sat mapped it, seen us hit the ground in Dogtown. Unless... Unless the plot goes deeper. Hansen spreading his agitprop lies as we speak. I'm sure of it. Our people will have an even harder time crossing the border. I just... Fuck! I don't know what to do. Understand your concerns. Don't forget you got me here, though. You? And Songbird. We'll get you out of this mess. Thank you, V. We stick to the plan. After that, well, I guess we'll see. Wait a second. Damn it! If Hansen's got someone inside in Washington, that means I'm traceable. Wherever, whenever. I have a subdermal tracker. It needs to go ASAP. It's near an artery that's best not nicked. I'll need your help. Assume you know what you're doing. Be completely on your own without the tracker. Well, you're here. Okay, so far? Uh, don't have a choice. <sighs> okay, okay. Wait, wait, is that... Drone, finish up, quick. Cover it now! Shit! They can see us! Got us going down. Not for long. V? I'm here. Right on time. You in one piece? For now. Can't see how to stay that way. You need to get to the top of the building. Talk later. Got Songbird on comms. Says we gotta climb higher. Lead the way. It's your city, after all. Time to haul ass!
We'll ask our guardian angel if she can get this elevator moving. Elevator could use a runner's touch, Song. Already on it. Uh-huh. Sorry, V. My magic's no good here. What we need's power. There's a maintenance shaft with a fuse box nearby. Fall the scaffolding. Says I need to turn the lights back on. Might take a minute. Fine. I'll keep my head down. Do you think it'll work? Lousy place to get stuck. Just one way to find out.
the probability a random passerby noticed a moving elevator in an abandoned hotel? <sighs> right. Leave the analytics to Songbird. Little fuckers are fidgety. Sharp sensors on those. If they've sensed us already, the place will be swarming in no time. Great reason to move on and keep moving. My thoughts exactly. And mine. Just stay calm and keep quiet. Position. Something best avoided. Where'd that fucker go? They catch us out here, we're dead. Grow the wrist, huh? Why? It's stupid. It's not just your life on the line. That didn't take too long. Four wheels, two seats. Let's grab them.
detecting multiple patrol sigs, V. Stay on your toes. We have a plan we need to stick to. Elizabeth Crestry, that's where you need to go. You'll take old metro tunnels. Find the nearest station beneath an abandoned exit hall. Copy that. Brief Myers, can you? We should all be on the same page. Songbird's leading us to a metro tunnel. Need to pass through an expo hall. Exposed to the streets. Just not where we want to be. These scumbags won't let up. Lose them before accessing the garage. Alert. Myers sighted in Sector 2-1. Investigate, now! We better evac. Yo, patrol! The fuck's going on? Waiting on a sig. Outpost. Best go around. Just avoid open spaces, okay? Let's not tempt fate. What? Where are you going? We're easy targets out there. Even easier to trace and track in a car. Gotta lose them fast. <sighs> I hope you know what you're doing. Could have gone worse. We better evac.
dog town. What a joke. Did you all nuke this place? You all. First time I'm here. Likewise. And if I never make it back, it'll be too soon. like a kind of museum. <laughs> the Museum of Wishful Thinking. Where the rich bought and sold so many unfulfilled dreams. Uh-huh. Seen my fill of gonk magnet ventures like this. Huh. In a past life? What was it? Real estate? Entertainment? Arasaka, actually. Research and development, broadly speaking. Specializing in... Data acquisition. Quaint name for corporate espionage. Quaint indeed. No need to delay. It's a good sign. You think so? I really prefer lively places. Feel free to ask her about those exhibits. Really wonder what she'll say.
gilded monument to a certain someone's bloated ego. <laughs> Takes one to know one. A bright future, with the right financing. But wars scare off investors. Wars don't happen out of the blue. This, no exception. Orders were issued. There's the Rosalind Myers I know. Never a shadow of accountability. It was an urban renewal effort, designed to curb Arasaka's growing influence. Militech backed most of the projects. So Militech sank money into Dogtown, too? That's not what it was called then, but yes. On paper, urban renewal. Under that cover, military infrastructure development. But abandon all hope of hearing a word of truth. Songbird, got a sitch. Can you jimmy the door? On it. Ugh, the lock jammed. Gotta brute force it, V. Time to roll up your sleeves. No need. Three, two, one. <laughs> All right. Head for the elevator, just across the room. Huh. One of Hansen's warehouses, it seems. Gotta find an elevator, other side of the room. What is it now? Let's move, please. This is no time to stop and think. No time to stop and think. This is no time to stop and think. Bad news this time. Hansen's dogs caught your scent. Assault incoming. You probably got spotted outside. Either way, get ready. What now? 
got a surprise for our guests. Making the final adjustments now. Myers, we gotta engage him. Song's on the case. Bird, what's with you? What the hell is going on, V? Dunno, Song's having a fit or something!
didn't get rough. You're not dying on me today. <sighs> no. <laughs> Guess not. Right. Good. We take it out? The fall did. About time we caught a break. <clears throat> Can't stay here. Are you mobile? Destroy you. Aim for it, sweet bit. Watch the laser.
Safeguarding the nation, my ass. <sighs> Close call, Matt. <sighs> Good teamwork. And luck. A pile of luck, V. Grab what you can, and let's head out. There has to be an exit here, somewhere. Let's try this one.
What's this? Good stuff. I just hope this won't be a dead end. Songbird said to keep to the tunnels all the way to Elizabeth Crest Street. Any chatter from her? Zero. Dead quiet. Still. Not good. Come on! Fuck. Got a hatch here. Could we jump, maybe? Let's pause. Think for a sec. What's eating you? I don't like this. Can you try calling so me again? Okay, gonna give it a shot. You're the songbird. Starting to worry us, girl. Song, are you there? No answer, huh? I guess you got me and only me. Great to see you again, Johnny. Curb the enthusiasm, kid. Never know. Could need me. So? Did you reach her? Nothing. No response. Shit. What happened back there? With so me? Something was off for sure. Could say she got hit with a demon. Maybe tripped a defense protocol on the Chimera's ice. Could say? Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. If Songbird was a cookie-cutter runner. Both know she's not, though. Damn fucking straight. But who knows? Nah, whole thing was a clusterfuck. You know, no net run comes without a burn risk. No. Impossible. Somi's had occasional off moments lately. Temporary slumps. But I'm sure she's headed where we're headed. Same destination she gave us. It's the reasonable thing to do. Right. Reasonable. Girl's gonna have a hell of a hangover. If she wakes up. We're heading southwest now. Feels like we're circling back. Uh-huh. Song mentioned an abandoned building. Place to lie low. No heat sick, so should be relatively safe. I pray you're right, so me. Use a little help. Of course. Oh! A damn fork? Well, we didn't account for this. Which way now? Thoughts? Let's try this way. Looks promising. Cameras? Here? Pencils and militaries. Love control. in here. Should plug that. Hook for a valve.
Here we go. Looks like a control room. nine times. You believe it? She must have had her ass welded to that seat. Funny how she has her own street in Night City. Place. Uh, not now! V, are you? One sec! It'll pass. <clears throat> <clears throat> See? <clears throat> Better already. What's the matter? Are you hurt? Yeah, I could say that. Old wound. One that literally has you on the floor. Got an... experimental Arasaka biochip in my brain. It's killing me, literally. So me says she might have a solution. Wait. You're talking about the relic. That'd be the one. A secretive tech someone stole from Arasaka. On the day Saboro lost his battle with mortality, no less. Bingo. So that's how she could reach you. It also goes a long way toward explaining the nature of your deal. I appreciate the candor. Seems it's all for one and one for all, if we're to survive. Expect in more trouble? Tonight? I expect nothing but. It's best to be prepared for any contingency. Okay, this is us. Eight. Great place for an ambush. Hopefully no one else thinks so. Tell me. Huh, guess we got here first. 
Seems so. I'll have to sit tight. Though I assume I'd rather not sit in the dark. Power would be useful. We could also get the radio up and running. What? Can't miss our daily dose of fear-mongering? We need to know the situation on the ground. I want to change out of this mess. High time. Change? Into those filthy old rags? These filthy old rags won't be smeared all over every TV and terminal screen in the city. Unlike my presidential best. Have a look around. I'll join you in a minute. Check this, V. Attempted postmodern art. More like a home cooked generator. Maybe we kickstart it, literally? Uh huh. Old Thornton engine, pretty run down. A little bit of chew left, too. If the fuel's not degraded, it could actually run. But can't start it. Not without a power source. Sure, but seeing as we got a lull in the lead pouring down on us. Listen, got a bad vibe about this. You? You? Bad vibes? <sighs> Big surprise. Songbird, S-tier netrunner, promises a panacea, a cure-all, then gets wiped off the map. Myers. Shady Politico. Got a dagger thrown at her back all the way from Washington. Who by and why? Fuck if we know. Oh, plus Kurt Hansen and this fucking Sam launcher. Just preem. Got this hot itchy feeling in my groin. Like someone's not fessed up to something. Huh. Saying Songbird didn't give us the full picture. Our mystery girl. Usually love a bit of hard to get, but trust me, rarely ends well. Well, not like we had time to really chat. Spent most of it running. SF1, run. Chimera, run again. It's just... Nah. Got some questions for the chick. Hope we get a chance to ask him. Anyway, let's get this power sitch sorted. Fire it up. Fingers crossed. Here it goes. And amaze balls. Look what I found. What do you say? There's more in the fridge. Feel free. You earned it. Booze? This a good time? 
Let's see, today I survived a Delta crash, a district-wide manhunt, and a prototype killer robot. Yes, it's a great fucking time. New look? Great. Right? Should draw less attention, too. Grab a go. Just earned yourself a vote, Madam President. Are you even registered? Housewarming gift from Songbird, maybe? <sighs> Wouldn't it be wonderful? And circling back to Night City, speculative chatter continues tonight around the downed passenger craft. And U.S. representatives claim President Rosalind Myers was aboard when catastrophe struck. City officials have yet to release any statement. However, one all-too-familiar figure did decide to speak out. Kurt Hansen, the self-proclaimed leader of Dogtown, called a press conference earlier today to offer his take on the situation. I'm being framed, isn't it obvious? The NUSA's been out for my blood for years. Now I'm not without flaws. But another thing I'm not is suicidal. An attempt on the life of the head of the NUSA? What transpired in Dogtown is no trivial matter. I urge you all to consider the true motives behind this... spectacle. The NUSA will take any excuse it can get to send forces into Dogtown. And will they stop there? <laughs> no. You. Good people of Night City are next in the fucking line. Shit. Mark my Fuck words. This. Troglodyte's clever. Maybe too clever for his own good. Oh, so Hansen's decided to wave a classic false flag. So doubt, reap apprehension towards any in USA attempt to get you back. Both ends fight in the middle. Well, you sure know how to cheer people up. Some mysterious party's out to trigger war. An attempt on my life's a damn good case of spell eye. Gotta let Washington know you're alive ASAP. Ah, call Washington without knowing who'll answer, friend or foe. Or should I go outside? Give Hanson snipers a big thumbs up. No, V. Neither's an option. Hear that? Footsteps. Songbird. Maybe. Can't be sure, though. It's our lucky day, Shumba. A penthouse with a view of the sits, eh? Hey. And lights that work. This doesn't feel right. That never does what you, does it? Fucking killjoy. You want an angle on Hansen's airdrops? You got it. V, we need to eliminate them. Come on, man. Let's have a look around. Wait. Wanna try I'll talking there. first? I hope you know what you're doing. Weapons! Now! What the fuck? I won't say it again. Yo, 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 chill. Just looking for a place to hold up for the night. This one's taken, clearly. Told you. So I see. This the uh, presidential suite. Shit. Word is, they a bounty on the head of Rosalind Myers. What we gonna do about that? Come on, guys. Let's figure something out. We don't want any problems. Iron in my face, say otherwise. This iron will stay silent so long as you do. Now that's an idea. But our silence ain't come cheap, yeah? Whoa. Pump the brakes, man. Not now, Tay. I was negotiating. Do you remember negotiating with Hanson? What happened? Not now. Live to see another day. Always something. In <laughs> Dogtown? Oh boy. Lucky me. Who said anything about Dogtown? Scratch my back and I'll scratch yours. I have the power to get you out of here. Give you a new city. A new identity. Chance to start over. Jacob. And what's that supposed to look like, exactly? There's enough space for four. Should be easy to stay out of each other's way. 
But if any uninvited guests arrive, we'll be counting on you to stand with us. This is your chance. There won't be another. Shit. But it might could be our last. You got a deal, Madam Prez. And... Want me a ray field. Jesus Christ. Aha. Uh -huh. Any model in particular? Shit, my ass will fit them all the same. Tell me where you want it parked. Will do. So long as your bodyguard don't slit our throats come nighttime. Well, V, do you plan to slit these two throats? Jim, just mind your manners. Okay, I promise, Mama. Well, all fucking right. We got us a deal. I like to celebrate new chooms by tossing back a few. But T and I gots to be sharp. Airdrops come morning. Gotta get up early. Same here. Come on, V. It's been a hell of a long day. Watch the master and learn, T. Watch and learn. You're gonna get us one of these days. Maybe. But at least you'll kick it with a smile on your face and your ball's in the right place. You pull the night shift? Well, we could call it my part of the deal. And an old habit from the Badlands. So, you a nomad? I was. Once upon a time. Abandon your family? I betrayed them. I'd rather not get into it. What's up, V? Shoot some shit with me? Then spill it, girl. Working for the Prez. What's it like? Feds probably pay stacks, yeah? Every hour brings new challenges. Can't tell you more than that. Yo, no doubt, no doubt. Hang with the right peeps? I bet the whole world opens its legs. Business trips, Lux hotels, Joy toys on demand, Ganic meat. Happy hour in orbit? I mean, shit! Like a fucking rock star. Like a fucking rock star. Anyway, you made a wise choice for an overnight. Safe, out of the way. It's even got work and power. So, one thing I don't get. Building safe, right? So why is it a total ghost town? Right. Well, that's because it's haunted. But don't worry, baby. You safe with me. Jacob. It's true. A lot of peeps died here. Mysterious circumstances. Like an aneurysm, each and every one. One time, 12 runners they found. All their brains fried. Hansen closed the house down, banned entry. And the colonel's word means lots more than some turrets and shit. Folks know to stay away. So what are we still doing here? Cause fuck them, that's what. And fuck urban legends. Mention Kurt Hansen. You and him got some kind of beef? See this junk? Hansen's goons took my Ganic leg. <sighs> That's tough. Was a conflict of interest. Colonel Dipshit don't appreciate motivated entrepreneurs like myself. Wanted to start a little side biz, yeah? But I forgot all about the registration fee. Now I serve as a warning to the rest. Mentioned airdrops before. What's that about? It's like this. Colonel Hansen runs a big market, but he's landlocked, right? Gotta get his shipments in somehow. Talking iron, ammo, meds, fucking anything. All falling out of the sky and into Kurt's lap. Now, 
if you know where and when to look, might fall into your lap instead. Feel me? Telling me finders keepers. Clipping from Kurt. It's kid stuff. Trickle down economics, I call it. Finally. My legs are killing me. Come on. Still nothing from so me. Radio silence. She's never gone dark this long. Troubling, to say the least. How you feel about our roommates? None too bright. Not entirely useless. And two extra guns could always prove handy. I gonna give him that payday, really? Why wouldn't I? They're taking a sizable risk. So, what if Songbird don't show? We need to wait. It's all we can do for now. If she doesn't show, well, then I'll have one other option to consider. But let's table it till morning. We should get some rest. <laughs> Surreal. All of it. What's that? I'd have been home by now. Reading the evening brief, glass of water and two sleeping pills waiting on the night table. Doesn't sound like you miss it much. Hmm. See you in the morning, V. She's on the balcony. She's not here. I Means she's not coming. It's been, what, 12 hours since the crash? Enough time to flee Dogtown, that's sure. She'd never leave me behind. Protocol? Friendship. I need to find her. You don't leave your people behind enemy lines. Could I still buy that fairy tale bullshit? Whatever happened, we have to help her. Listen, know we had a calm night, but you gotta leave Dogtown. How? In a car trunk? Fingers crossed? Anson's waiting for that sort of desperate attempt. Okay, gotta be away. Me think... Uh, know my share of fixers. Bet we could get one to... Out of the question. They'll hand me over to the highest bidder.
Gotta find her myself, sounds like. On my own. Not entirely. I have just the person to help. Solomon Reed's the name. Seven years ago, he headed up our intense efforts in Night City. He and Somi were a team. With the conflict over, he went into hibernation. So he's out there somewhere. Reed's a man of principle. He can't be swayed, can't be bribed. If there's anyone we can trust now, it's him. Sleeper agent. No shit. Tell me more. Unless it's like a state secret or whatever. It is. Of the false bottom drawer variety. Let's say you want to secure your interests on another country's soil. If diplomacy fails, you resort to other means. Like a military coup? That's one option. Solomon Reed is another sure one. Seven years undercover. Guy sounds like a true asset. Used to be with Arsaka once upon a time. Counter intel. Never saw any Reed on file. Above your pay grade, maybe? Consider that. Maybe I was too busy getting my hands wet and dirty. So, that's a yes. Go back, up your clearance, and check again. Just might. One day. Don't mention it to Reed. I don't need you in a body bag. Uh, another one with an eternal grudge against Arasaka. Reed has good reasons. How do I find your guy? Guessing I can't just buzz him on his work hollow, huh? Activating a sleeper agent is no simple matter. You'll need a dog whistle. A what now? Don't tell him I called it that. It's a signal only Reed will hear. It'll be tricky. Huh. There was a secret comms channel accessed only from a Capitan Caliente nearby. The FIA used it before the war. The access code was... 0931. Got a bad feeling, V. Mean an, an analog landline? That crashed your open a hole in space-time? When sending sensitive information, you use the technology least vulnerable to interception, old or not. A Caliente should still be wired for it. Owner have a thing for antiques? He had a thing for federal money. And he might still be alive. Remember, 0931. Okay, seems doable. And I prefer discretion to destruction. I trust that's clear. Mm-hmm, so what'll happen next? Reed will need to screen you. You'll show him this. It means you work for us. What the? The file will be created for you in the FIA database. Wait, back up. Telling me I'm a special agent now? That's right. But taking the oath make it feel more real. Secret comms line, presidential token, what's next? A coded message in today's screen sheet? That token is for your safety. If Reed isn't 100% certain I sent you, he won't hesitate to kill you. Yeah, no, let's skip the formal thing. Is there a problem? It's just a big commitment, you know? Can't swear to something I don't believe in. It's your choice. I understand this was sudden. Good luck out there, V. And don't let the bastards nab you. Where's Jacob? Fresh airdrop nearby. Jay went down for a look-see. Sleep okay? Night all right? Like any with a roof overhead. Claustrophobic. As for Jacob, he thrives in Greenland. Come on, baby. Ever ridden in a wayfield? My villa with VIP friends? High society? On and on to the crack of dawn. Not men with ambitions, clearly. Those in a deviated septum. 